The JN1 Chases next. This is a grade one. Over three miles. At the top, we've got Flintoff waiting for James Shea. Was a winner last week. Gold Coast Kevin Meenhan also a winner last week. As was the broken one for Joshua Sutherland. Watch Disorder won the week before for Leon Van Rensburg. Wisdom for Alex Cherry. Blood Eagle also a week one winner for Leon Van Rensburg. Cape Solitude for Darren Thompson has been twice second. Fiddler's Bino for David Robertson. Joe Mon and Mig for Craig Beckwith. And Velvet Top for Graham Clitterbuck. So 11 then. Called in and away. Pretty short run to the first. They're all safely to the other side of it. They've got 17 more obstacles to take. Gold Coast pulling for its head as they go into that ditch. Really does want to go on, but it looks like me or Craig Beckwith is also interested in the lead. The one that's really, really wide on the track down here is um, Darren Thompson's horse as they get over the third. That's Cape Solitude. Also, Velvet Top for Grand Clutterbuck is pretty wide on the track as well. Right there. Spread right across the track, really, and Gold Coast has now settled down into the lead. With Mig in second. And then Cape Solitude third, the broken one is fourth. Then Flintoff Whitted is after that one, and Watch Disorder, and Blood Eagle, and Jomont, and Fiddler's Bino, and then finally Velvet Top, and at the back of the pack, Wisdom. So Gold Coast and Migden will lead them into the next. A three or four length gap then to the broken one who's just about third. Cape Solitude one on the track fourth. So they just come over that hilly bit and take the fourth. And they're all safely over the fourth. With Wisdom just getting a little bit detached at the back about three lengths away from the rest of them. So Gold Coast is the leader by two to Mig in second. Getting down to the fifth. Which they all stream over nicely. Flintoff winnings now move through into third on the inside of the broken one. Joe Mon is fifth. Then comes Cape Solitude and Velvet Top, the two that are wide. After that one is Fiddler's Bino. The two Leon Van Rensburg horses are running together. Blood Eagle and Watch Disorder. And the one that's just out of shot at this moment in time is Wisdom for Alex Cherry as they take number six which they all get to the other side of nicely and Gold Coast continues to lead as they come up past the stand take this fence it'll be the last time the next circuit and over it they all go with Gold Coast leading by three to me in second and Flintoff Wood in third the broken one is fourth and Cape Solitude is moving just a little bit closer to the fence now. Joe Mons after that one. Velvet Top still very wide. Then Fiddler's Bino and Watch Disorder. Blood Eagle as they get over the eighth. And with Wisdom now getting much closer at the back. Short onto the next ditch. And they get over that one. The one that was a little bit slow was Mig. The broken one has jumped up into second. Flintoff winning is also making up a line of three there. Cape Solitude's back in fifth. Velvet top still wide, then Joe Mon and Fiddler's Bino. Velvet as they get over the next one, and Gold Coast hit that one hard, got away with it. Continues to lead from the broken one in second. Big on the inside of Flintoff Wedding. Then Cape Solitude, Joe Mon and Fiddler's Bino getting much closer. Good jump on the outside by Velvet Top, Blood or Eagle and Watch Disorder still race together, and Wisdom has just dropped off the pace again as they come to the 12th. Joe, Joe Mon was the one that made the mistake that time. But Gold Coast continues to lead into the next ditch. Gets over it nicely. Mig over it one in second. All still on their feet. The broken one is third. Cape Solitude still running a little wide in fourth. And Flintoff winning as they take the 14th. And they're all safely over the 14th with Gold Coast. Two lengths up. On the broken one in second. Flintoff winning, sitting quietly in third. Mig still going well on the inside of that one. Cape Solitude still running wide on the track. Then Joe Mon and Fiddler's Bino. And Blood Eagle starting to get a bit closer. As Velvet Top just drops back a little bit. Watch Disorder is also making a forward move now. Wisdom is pretty much out of it, I would say. But it's Gold Coast. 
who's kicking on in the lead. Two lengths clear of the broken one in second. Me in third. They're queuing up behind that one. There might be six or seven in a line ready to challenge for third as they make their way into the final five furlongs. And Gold Coast has been in the lead pretty much all the way. But now Blood Eagle is making a significant looking move around the outside as they take the fourth from home. And it's Gold Coast who landed in the lead. Blood Eagle second. Jomon is coming around the outside of that one. Then comes the broken one. Then Watch Disorder trying to get closer. Cape um, Solitude is trying to get into it as well. And they're down to the third last. And Gold Coast have jumped there by Blood Eagle who's now taking it up. Watch this order moves into third. Joe on fourth. Cape Solitude running on again on the outside. They've got just two to jump now. And it's Blood Eagle who's coming down towards this second last being chased by his stable mate. Watch this order. Cape Solitude being wide on the track all the way. He's still third. The broken one's back in fourth. Difficult to see anything else winning this over the second last they go. And the wisdom's been pulled up at the back. Blood Eagle is clearing the lead into the final furlong. Down towards the final fence. It's Blood Eagle in the lead but Cape Solitude is getting closer up the centre of the track over the final fence they go Cape Solitude jumped it quicker and Blood Eagle is treading water and Cape Solitude sweeps into the lead and after two seconds Cape Solitude makes it a win Blood Eagle is second and broke one third then watch this order in German and flints off winning and fiddlers by now and Gold Coast may have ended up the last one to finish as Cape Solitude stayed wide all the way around and then a nice turn of foot over the final fence to take it. So second for the last two weeks, Cape Solitude gets into the winner's circle this week for Darren Thompson. Blood Eagle for Leon van Rensburg was second. The broken one, Joshua Sutherland third. Watch disorder, Leon van Rensburg was fourth. And Jomon for Craig Beckwith was fifth.